Greetings everyone. In this video, we'll be looking at uh, NC level one tables, equations, and graphs uh, achievement standard. So some of the skills covered will be sketching a linear graph and then uh, finding the equation of a linear graph. Uh, so we'll look at the fixed example. It says sketch the graph of um, H, uh, which is given in meters, um, is equal to uh, minus two T plus three. To sketch uh, this graph, you will need to create a table. Uh, it's very straightforward. Just uh, create a table and then uh, you uh, plot these points uh, on the uh, number grid and then uh, join these points uh, using a straight line and uh, you will end up with a graph of this function. So the table will uh, look something like this. So we've got T values. So pre-select uh, T values. So in this case, I've used uh, 0, 1, 2 and 3. And then uh, the corresponding uh, age values will be um, obtained by replacing the... Um, uh, t values in the function. You can uh, use your calculators to uh, work out the answers. So the first um, t value is 0, so you got negative 2 times 0 is 0, plus 3 is uh, 3, so that's how I got uh, 3 over here. Then you replace t by 1, so minus 2 times uh, 1 is minus 2, minus 2 plus 3 is uh, 1. And likewise, uh, replace t by 2, so negative 2 times 2 is uh, minus 4, minus 4 plus 3 is minus 1. And uh, finally, I've got uh, 3, so negative 2 times 3 is um, negative 6, negative 6 plus 3 is uh, minus 3. So we've got the first point 0, 3, so 0, 3, which is over here. Then the second one is uh, 1, 1, very easy to plot this, but make sure the horizontal axis is red first, then the vertical, so x, y in uh, uh, general form. So in this case, we have got time in uh, seconds, for example, height in meters. And uh, so we plot uh, 0, which is the T value first, so 0, 3, which is over here, uh, 1, 1, uh, 2, negative 1, and then uh, 3 with minus 3, which is over here. And then you just join these uh, using a straight line. And there you have it, uh, pretty straightforward. That's your um, graph of um, minus 2t plus 3. Our next uh, skill that you will need to um, know is uh, giving the equation of a straight line. I've already covered this in my previous um, videos um, in another topic which was um, linear graphs. If you haven't already, please do check that one out. Um, so in this uh, video, I'm just going to use uh, tables and then uh, from there we can obtain the equation of this uh, line uh, rather than using um, y equals to mx plus c where m is the gradient, the rise over run, and c is the y-intercept. So let's uh, create a table. So in this case, the y-intercept is at 1, so 0, 1, and then 1 pairs up with 3, so 1, 3, and then I've got 2 with 5 and of course 3 with um, 7. So in this table you can see that the, the y values increase by 2 each time. So that becomes your gradient value. So we can say that uh, m value is 2. And then uh, we can read the y-intercept from the graph, which is our c value, straight away. Or I can just use this method here. So if the m value is 2, and my first point, is 3 so 2 plus 1 will give you 3 so that becomes your y-intercept value or you can easily see that when x is 0 your y value was 1 so this is your y-intercept y-intercept always occurs when uh, x is 0 and you can see that clearly over here so you can put that information together so y-intercept of 1 m of 2 so y is equal to mx plus c so this will give you y is equal to 2x plus 1 pretty straightforward um, I could have used uh, rise over run. So here uh, you can check the other videos out. So go find rise over run. That will give you the gradient value. But from uh, the tables, I can easily get the equation. So I didn't use the other method. But if you are interested, uh, please do watch the other videos. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.